work when almost everyone else is ending their day, you might eventually feel a bit off kilter. More than 22 million Americans are in the same boat. Mark Charter visited the St. Alexia Sleep Center and has important information on sleep schedules and shift work. Mark? That's right, Alan. Sleep is one of the most important things the human body needs in order to perform at its best. However, if shift workers don't get the right amount of sleep, it can cause some serious problems. There are four stages of sleep, one, two, three, and REM. If your REM cycle gets messed up, your body doesn't get the rest it really needs, and that doesn't bode well for those on shift work. You have headaches all the time, you're sluggish. Some days I would go where you get up and you have errands to do because you want to be like with normal people, and so you don't even get any sleep, and then by six o'clock you just crash. Sleep experts say taking breaks at work, eating a healthy diet filled with protein and carbohydrates, and taking naps during time off all play an important role when it comes to eliminating that six o'clock crash. If they wake up, you know, to be with their family at eight and they have to work at eight that evening, you know, a good two to four hours during that day should be, you know, dedicated to probably taking a nap. Now, sleep experts also say that staying away from smoking, drinking alcohol, and heavily exercising before bed will help the body maintain sleep every night. Smoking acts as a stimulant, and drinking also has its problems. Although you may be sleepy, you know, after you've had those few drinks, you don't stay asleep for long because that body or the brain just keeps waking up. Maintaining a sleep schedule isn't always easy, especially for shift workers. But it's important to never underestimate the power of a good night's rest. Now, if your body is continually deprived of sleep, it can lead to hypertension, diabetes, and even depression. Monica? All right, thanks a lot, Mark.